This is why the US President's visit to Northern Ireland is so significant. Joe Biden is here to recommit America to preserving the fragile peace in Northern Ireland. The United States has played a significant role in the journey from conflict. It was former President Bill Clinton who helped facilitate the IRA ceasefire and his envoy, Senator George Mitchell, who brokered the Good Friday Agreement 25 years ago. President Biden won't be in this corner of the United Kingdom for very long. He's not going to Parliament buildings at Stormont because there's no power-sharing government there at present. Instead, he'll address an audience at Ulster University, an indication perhaps that he believes it's up to the next generation to make the hopes of the Good Friday Agreement a reality. The Good Friday Agreement was a historic compromise between unionists and nationalists. They agreed that Northern Ireland would remain part of the United Kingdom until a majority here voted otherwise. They also agreed to share power in government. And terrorists agreed that they would destroy their weapons. There's a difficult political situation in Northern Ireland right now. The Democratic Unionists are boycotting the power-sharing government over the Brexit border in the Irish Sea. Joe Biden will call on all sides to restore that government as soon as possible, not least because the threat level here has increased from substantial to severe.